booty so big lord have mercy i just was crying on and off for like i'm tired it's just like i'm not about to cry on camera bro. Like, like I just stepped outside to get in the car and I look like I'm perspiring and I don't like it. But anyway, you see the title. I'm doing a little vlog today. Like, I'm about to go some places. I don't even know where all I'm going. I don't know. I might go to this little museum action that we got. I don't know. I'm kind of on a thrill. It's a lot. It's a lot to take in. But I'm taking out a lot of ladies. Put your seatbelt on. Let's ride. Somewhere in nowhere ass Oklahoma What is this? Oh, a rocket. This is too far. Oh no. This might have to leave with me. Everywhere I go, I buy a purse. It's slithering, period. I don't know for it. Um, this is coming. We I'm good with this. I need but this is what I have so far. The little shelf thingy, the boho purse, and then this little stool. Big purr. Stuff that I feel like is haunted, like dolls and stuff like this is haunted, period. I don't know about that. It's kind of cute and a haunted ass way, you know. Okay, but wait, y'all. Look at this one. Look at this clutch. It's dirty.
give her ass or no? <laughs> Bye, period. <laughs> Why is there so much zebra ass out here? Like, what is this? Double cheeked up. That was cool. I ain't never been there before. It was kind of litty. I had a good time. I had a good little time, you know. Uh, it's a vibe. What the fun? But that was that was cool. That was decent thrifty. I think I'm gonna go home. I really want to take a nap, but I don't got time. I got a date. And now I'm 40 today. And I really want to be a super bad bitch because I haven't been one in a minute, like on some date. So I can't be a super baddie without my nails done. Personally, that's just not going to happen. It's not going to work out. So I think I'm about to just go do something with my nails. And I think I'm supposed to go to this other thing today. And I just realized it didn't happen. But we about to see. We got to see what it's, what it's looking like. I'm about to do my nails the same. I got this and it matches my existing aesthetic. It's look kind of white. I, I thought it was pink. Let me turn another light on. Let me see. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's like a super pale pink. Super duper pale. Um, but let me look up, let me look up what these be costing because they definitely don't be ten dollars, okay? And then I also got this little boho hippie bag, which is beautiful, it's like heavy, and I'm excited. I can't wait to put the nine in this, okay? This is adorable. That's all I got. Cute socks and ankle bracelets is my fucking thing, period, okay. So this is where I always start when I get ready to do my nails. Like, what colors am I going to use today? But what's another cute color to mix with this? And these are all like those Beatles gel polishes you can get on Amazon. They're really dope. You just, I mean, they serve the purpose. And that's what it's all about, serving the damn purpose. So let's just, let's just move on. <laughs> oh, this, oh, hold on. We might need to change the whole vibe. Look at this for your wrap, baby. This is sexy. Oh no, let me put that to the side. So I do press ons because I've come to see that the way I work at work, my press ons last just as long as if I get full blown acrylics. It's really ridiculous. Cause I'm popping nails off opening boxes and all kind of stuff. So why waste as much time when I can decorate the entire nail and then throw it on? And so I've traded colors out into greens. Oh, y'all don't even know where I'm going with it, but I'm going. This feels so sexy. Look at the little, little lime speckles. It's about to be up. Na, 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 na. Ah! All right, so it's time to head out. My room looks a freaking mess because that's how I always look after I get ready to go somewhere. But we is cute, okay? Let me just turn the light back on so y'all can see the visuals, okay? So this is how the nails end up turning out. Let me show y'all the fitty though. Ooh, you can 
don't even see nothing but booty so big. Lord, have mercy. <laughs> I'm sure I'll get a better video probably there or something. But I'm out. I'm out the door. Let's go. Okay. Uh, smoke and grab a little leaf. Yeah. And my dad not cheap. Uh, 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 ride with a little freak. Uh, uh, she gonna suck me to sleep. Uh, What's up, y'all? So it's like three in the morning. Um, my day was cool. Just a little movie day. I haven't been in a movie theater since before COVID. Like it's been so long. But y'all, life is ratchet. Like, like adulthood is ratchet. And it's just really crazy because I keep finding myself in these, like, emotional cul-de-sacs. <laughs> like, dealing with those fine lines between what you want, need, and what you feel like you deserve. Because all three things can be the same thing. All three things can be completely different. Sometimes you don't know what you want. Sometimes you don't know what you need. Sometimes you don't know what you deserve. Like, it's just really, it's just a cluster. Like, I don't know. And these are things that have always been evident and things you think about and worry about. But they've been on me heavy. Like, the shit has been on me so heavy. Like. I just was crying on and off for like, I'm tired, it's just, I'm not about to cry on camera, bro. I was just crying for like, I mean, I, after having a day, bro, I vlogged my whole day, like nothing was just, you know, overwhelming about my day. But it's just like, when you really sit down and you think about life, like, it just be like, bro, like some of the shit that you encounter really like eats away at you like some of the things you have to deal with can be so burdening on just your mental that it really can fuck you up randomly like i don't know you can see where i was already crying i'm real fucking childish and ugly bro but you know it's like how you overcome stuff. That's the most important part, I guess. Taking a path that is righteous is how you overcome stuff. But choosing the path is such a hard, such a hard fucking thing to do, I guess. Actually physically turning the wheel and cutting down that path so much more harder. It's just like a lot of stuff that meant nothing or or was not really on my mind you know five years ago it's like on my on my head as soon as I wake up type shit. like I don't know and it could be that 30 stuff it could be 30 like you just look at life in a different perspective like I've been on this earth 30 years like you think about all the relationships you have with people friends family like what was the basis of the friendship? Like, what was the basis of the relationship? What what did I gain in the relationship? Like, even just dealing with your family. It's just like, are you bringing me pain? Are you bringing me happiness? Like, what is your overall purpose for getting a response out of me? For talking to me? Because it really come down to nothing but time. Like, like 30 years when you just think about that 
Like, like, and you can think about that at any, any point of your life at 21, at, at 25, you know what I'm saying? You could just think like, think about what somebody has done while they were with you, how their mindset has been, how you both have evolved, how, how things change and how things don't. Oh no. Even with, with your parents, you know what I'm saying? Just like, like, what do you think about me? How do you treat me? Then versus now, is, is that what I deserve? You just got to like, I don't know. You got to do what's right for you, period. At the end of the day, what's right for you is the only thing that matters. It doesn't matter how long somebody has known you. It doesn't matter how long somebody had. Oh, you see my. The light hit the ice. It twinkled and glistened <laughs> on my nose ring. But like. Damn, I'm squirrel. But anyway, like, it just be like, do you let something continue as is if you don't like it? Only you can change your life. Only you can improve your life. Like, outside forces can impact you negatively or positively, but what you do with the outside forces is what's important that's the only thing that matters like you know mm -hmm. <sighs> but yeah life is crazy alright I'm gonna fuck with you alright bro